popularly known as the warm-blooded shark of the ABC reality show Shark Tank, Lori Greiner has definitely come a long way from being almost bankrupt to one of the biggest billionaires on the show. Let's talk about her in this video. Having a net worth of $100 million as an investor and an entrepreneur, the empire which Lori Greiner had started is now valued at $4.7 billion. She has had her course of struggles, thus earning the nickname the warm-blooded shark in a hard way. Although Lori Greiner isn't the richest shark on the show as her net worth is just $150 million, that doesn't change the fact that the 51-year-old Chicagoan seems to have cracked the code of surpassing the odds in such a way that you have become an inspiration for millions. Moreover, entrepreneurship is something which Lori Greiner had never even planned to pursue as she had originally planned of becoming a playwright. Being one out of two of the regular female panelists on the ABC popular show, her girl next door persona initially gained her the reputation of the nice shark. But that doesn't mean that this pleasant personality of hers ever conflicted with her shrewd decisions when it came to business. In an interview, Lori Greiner credited her high IQ as the sole reason behind her success rate is 90% on the new item's launch. Lori Greiner's story is being known as the nice shark to being called the warm-blooded shrewd shark, has taken a lot from her and taught her a few lessons which she wishes to carry along with her until the very end. Well, as they say, being successful takes a long road, so no one needs to start as soon as possible. So is the case with Lori as well. From an early age, her parents always emphasized her being a businesswoman rather than working under a company as an employee. Greiner graduated as a student of film, TV, and journalism from the Loyola University of Chicago and always aimed at becoming a playwright. Her business skills were sharp from day one, which could easily be known from her plays knacking for the small screen. As soon as she had started writing, she even started her own production company known as The Good Place Entertainment. Although Lori and her husband don't have children together, she always focuses on mentoring young people with the lessons which she learned the hard way over time. Things started to take a turn for Griner after she earned her first million dollars just by selling jewelry storage pieces. During the mid-90s, she took a short break from writing and was able to get a $300,000 loan in order to give wings to her very first product. The first product which she designed hit the markets like a tsunami, thus taking her straight from rags to riches, all thanks to a plastic organizer which could organize up to 100 earrings. She used to advertise her products through different channels, which would broadcast in several other states of America, thus becoming an instant hit. Lori Greiner had also hosted a shopping channel called QVC's Clever and Unique Creations, which earned her the nickname of QVC Queen, as she had hosted it for about 20 years straight. Within the span of just three years, Lori's business had already made $10 million, and she went on to develop over 1,000 more products for both men and women. This had earned her the patent for 120 products both in the U.S. and abroad. Her business mainly focuses on accessories, kitchen-related products, and other organizers. Being one of the regular investors on the panel of Shark Tank, Lori Greiner makes over $50,000 per episode. Her name goes down as one of the best investors on the show, as this QVC queen has invested in 10 out of 20 most successful companies on the show. Out of these 10, a few of the biggest successes she had on the show has been in the form of Scrub Daddy, Reader Rest, Squatty Potty, and a few more. During season four of the show, she had invested in the Scrub Daddy startup which presented a reusable sponge in the shape of a smiling face, which changes its shape as contraction and expansion depending upon the temperature of the water. The QVC queen purchased a 20% stake of the company in return for $200,000, and the rest is history. As of today's date, Scrub Daddy is available in more than 30,000 retail stores in over 17 countries and is worth a whopping amount of $400 million. It is regarded as one of the most successful deals ever made on Shark Tank, and so Lori Griner bathes in profits as she sits down. Apart from Scrub Daddy, Lori invested in readers in the third season of Shark Tank, which focused on many people's issues of missing their glasses as well as scratching them. The entrepreneur of this company was willing to give up his entire company to Lori, but later the deal got settled for 65% of the stake in exchange for $150,000. Today, the company has over $8 million in sales. Similarly, a squatty potty in which Lori had 10% of the stakes of the company and joint investment with Bobby Edwards for $350,000 is also a winning deal. Click on one of these two videos on the screen right now.